Hey everybody, Astro Nerdboy here. It is time for episode 66 of our roster review series. Now, well, that's kind of how it's felt today. That's what kind of a day it's been, so I apologize in advance if my video doesn't feel um, as, um, yeah, as uh, that as it could. Um, but anyway, so total collection power is 9.6, almost 9.7 million. So, yeah, we keep pushing forward to 10. The Mary Sue watch is at uh, almost uh, 660. So that's the strongest arena team I have ever had. So it's pretty wild when I think that when I got back in the game, I was 750 total collection power, 750K. Um, and I have a team that's by itself just, you know, just a little under a hundred uh, of that. So, but uh, if we look at last week's, um, so yeah, so the Mary Sue watch has gone up a thousand, probably because of, of the uh, pumping up some, a little bit of Stark tech. And we were at 9.5 TCP last week. So otherwise nothing, uh, nothing of note really to mention there, um, but there you go and let us look at zeal roster this is a good roster project so the only reason proxima midnight is in here is because <laughs> every one of these is gear 15 so it makes it easy when i want to farm uh this stuff so tomorrow i'll be back i'll be i'll be farming this um I'll never farm this because for some reason the idiots in this game just, you know, they don't use this much. So we get 50 billion of them and never use them. But yeah, so she just makes a convenient character to, to farm pieces uh, that I need um, when it comes to these uh, uh, catalyst pieces. So that's the only reason she's in here. Otherwise, I'm not working on her. It's just a cheat. So, Yelena, same as always, just to push to seven stars. It's going to take forever. Um, X Factor are all at level 50, which is kind of cool. But they are the priority right now, so that hopefully when the next uh, Bozo uh, Adam Warlock event comes out, I will have uh, enough to unlock him. Now, the real trick will be, okay, you got enough to unlock him, but, you know, is he going to be too weak in mirror matches? That's going to be the million-dollar question. Because other people who already had him unlocked are going to take him, like, six stars, for example. So, and even seven stars, I'm guessing. So, I may need to farm all these smegheads to seven stars just for the freaking arena uh, meta. Which I'm gonna tell you is not gonna make me happy. I don't I don't enjoy that <clears throat> at all. Uh, but you know that it, it is what it is, I guess. But it's not something I'm looking forward to. Just put it away. Farming the seven stars is uh, never a uh, fun thing. Uh, but there you go. So other changes of note. Um. In my orb opening video, uh, I did an experiment because I thought I could get like a bunch of her shards and I got way less than, than um, supposedly the drop rate was 10% and um, yeah, it wasn't 10%. I can promise you that. I did not even, even at the seven drop rate for 10%, I did not get um 50 something charge for her i got like 32 or something i don't remember i have to look at the video again just to see but the bottom line is opening up arena orbs to try to get some more shards on her because really <clears throat> i mean she's really kind of a critical uh, component in the game and someone targets you i mean like mine is even though five red stars but still pretty weak, so um, 
but you know the arena orbs were trash totally pissed me off um but there's that uh jubilee got up to six stars so got that today so hit me daffy yeah that was pretty cool um but otherwise nothing really major up here i really wish i could get like a fifth red star in her or fifth gold star so i could get her fifth red star i've been trying i you know i can't get doom pieces or these blue pieces because we're not doing doom raids we won't be doing doom raids for a long time and i don't want to change alliances so uh yeah that's gonna be another thing that's it's all got me thinking about quitting the game so uh dr doom where are you there you are bud all right so i got his green iso of course you're not gonna be able to get any blue iso forever so um when we go into dark dimension four in a little bit we'll 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 discuss more about him we're getting close we're getting close it's kind of cool but so that's that's kind of it on the project side now when it comes to the rosters let's go into i do have one complaint um the when you're in blitz mode you can't just edit a team on the fly and save it that is so stupid who thought that was a smart idea to only be able to do this from the main screen i mean that's the dumbest thing ever hello it just kind of shows that the idiots that are developing this game are not playing it because you i always knew in my career when developers had no clue what they were that they were developing stuff for them and not for the actual end user and the end user experience would be total trash and the developers are like well why are you complaining this is beautiful no it sucks it doesn't it it, it, it may be beautiful for you because you don't have to use it every day so that's the situation we have there so but anyway enough of the ramp this is just a trash team uh to get through the blitz the first time and it's a, obviously a sure lose so um so that's where that's at now you notice I do have skilled military kind of built up here. Jessica Jones didn't have a home, so I put her in here. And on its win, at this lower level, it does okay. I am going to... Uh, actually, you know what? Let's do that now. Let's do that now. Let's see if we can find him real quick. We'll go down. <coughs> To the basement where the dregs are there you are i was gonna say when i was doing my experiment i did get quite a few shards of him so we'll go ahead and put that extra star on him i mean it'll make him a little bit better i need to obviously i need to give him some more levels um but for now we'll just give him the stars So let's go back into blitz yeah it wasn't enough to do anything here i mean he really does need to get up to like 60 65 uh to actually make this team somewhat a little bit more usable but i don't plan on using it more than just in 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 uh blitz to be honest so all right we got this trash team so this is the placeholders. I tend to use these two as placeholders a lot um, over the last probably year or so. But for the Shadowlands team. So this team, you know, I don't know. I've got it up here in the, still in the sure losses. Cause I think I need the other two components that it wins usually because by the time I get here um this has like a 50 50 shot of winning and 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 if this loses this will sure this will almost guaranteed win if they win then this one yeah you know 75 percent chance even being as uh, scrubby uh, as it is with with these two but we'll put we'll put two of the other characters in there get them to 60 you know 
at some point. X factors first, though. Um, you know, these things have to have priority. All right, so no, obviously no work there, but there's X Factor who's moving up the chain. So they've just moved up one. It won't be long before they're ahead of X Force, which is fine. I need, I do need to, I do need to work on X Force again because I would like to get my dock up another level. Um, but Arena trumps other stuff, so I mean it is what it is. Um, and because they don't have like a seven star Doc Hawk, it does make, you know, the legendary nodes in DD4 a little bit more challenging than they might otherwise be. So, um, yeah, so I, I went ahead and constructed the heroes for hire. I went ahead and just put enough resources so that, uh, Shang-Chi can get to, uh, level 60. So they're all level 60. You know, it's an even at level 60, there it's an annoying arena defense team. Will I take them to 65 so I can get them all to gear 12? I don't know. Um, not really that worried about. It. It's a war defense team. I mean, it's basically just to be an annoyance, and usually, any more and more. No one gets to my node anyway, so. Which is fine, but, you know. But in terms of offense or blitz, it's better than defenders, which is why I went ahead and broke up the defenders. So, you know, that's why I have, um, I think I have him down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I put him on the skill military and, you know, put her because she was homeless. But that's why they were homeless. And that's why she got taken off the ninja team, too, because, defend, uh, you know, defenders were broken up. So that's right. I did I did shift some stuff around and put a new ninja into this sure loss team. Um, so... So a lot of, so there was there has been a lot of shuffling. Let's put it that way. With the new team compositions and me wanting to do a bit more in Blitz, uh, that was you know that's where that originated. Huh. It's kind of weird that this says two minutes and the rest of them don't. But whatever. Something's wrong there, but it doesn't matter. Because I do these in the war. I think I think the game is just I think there's a bug, clearly. Because I've done all these, so for some reason it's just not showing it correctly. Um <coughs> sorry. So yeah, we just got Jubilee up to six stars, so that was cool. Uh, the one nice thing is they're all at at least at at level 71. I mean that's something I wanted to do, like with X Men. I'd rather do it with all my teams, you know, have them at least at 71, but, you know, you can only do what you can do, so. It is what it is. Yeah, like this team would greatly benefit from everyone being at 71. Um, yeah, like this one, they are at 71. Uh, this was another one of the shuffles. <laughs> You know, I just, I honestly, I just didn't know what to do. There's a part of me that thinks bring Doom in here for additional points. It's already, though, mostly a sure win with, with, I say mostly, I mean, it can still lose, but Silver Surfer with her, you know, giving extra heals and, and stuff. Um, it, it already works, so, you know, he doesn't add anything other than maybe some synergy with her because she's a villain, but otherwise, you know, he's just scrub. It, it really doesn't matter. I mean, Silver Surfer is carrying that team. So, but I was thinking about doing a situation like this where, okay, yeah, you got like a pretty much a surefire win, but, you know, bring in Doom and it's like more points. Yeah, I mean that is a valid strategy. There's there's nothing wrong with that, but uh, but at the same time, I don't know. I've got Doom further back. Back we could look for him real quick. 
Um, when we were scrolling up, I totally missed where I put him. I think I put him in the sure wins. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Again, another scrub team. Actually, actually, I hate this more than you know, mainly because he's a summoner. But so is he, and so is he. So, you know, they could flood the crowd the field, and basically, they actually kind of it really work against Doom. Doom needs to be bringing in his bots because one of his abilities is to have all his bots blow up. Well, if they've choked the field with their crap, then there's not that many bots to blow up. So, I don't know. <clears throat> I may do some more reshuffling. Um, Maybe take him off, but I, I, I honestly don't know. Uh, I don't really have. I really just, I don't really have a lot because you know I thought about putting Kingpin here, but Kingpin is the same problem. Kingpin's also a summoner, so it doesn't solve the problem. Although Kingpin, I mean, I mean, if I took these two off, put Kingpin on, I would need another villain um, to go in here. Or something. I don't, I don't know what. Kingpin would work, though. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm over here lost in thought. Because I'm trying to think. I honestly don't know what I want to do there. I honestly don't. So, And then there we go. We wrap it out. These are the two teams in the current um, blitz event you know where you got to blitz 80 billion times you know you don't want to even though you don't have the time um but where i shift it to manual and i burn extra energy to give them some extra attacks just to generate a little bit extra the as mobile gamer calls it dumpster fire currency But yeah, you know, in, in terms of arena, um, it was looking pretty bad there for a little while, but then all of a sudden it started looking better and, and I've been able to get, <clears throat> get in under 250 again for a while. So I don't know. It's a lot of RNG and I hate RNG with a passion. Get off my screen. He's not trying to sell me stuff. So Dark Dimension 4, I, I, I don't understand this at all. I'll be honest. I don't even understand how this happens. It's, it's, it just, how do you get through it in two hours and 45 minutes? Unless you're cheating. I, I just don't understand. I really don't. It doesn't make any sense to me how you can both do this in two hours and 45 minutes. But this is on the last node. We've done two attacks. The, it, it the, this node is, enraging to be sure because the they start with preloaded turn meter and it took eight tries before i got this much damage i mean i would get one turn in which what would i do i think i was using his alt to uh cancel uh, the enemy black widow's speed up that she put out on everyone and they all seem to get speed up regardless so okay everyone's got to slow down and then they'd all the enemy would get basically just kill three people it was disgusting so it's all pure rng um he get his terminator apparently there's something about him that he gets to always kind of go before most of the enemy and then you might get lucky in in the um dice roll and and some of your characters get to go that was what would happen and it looked like i was starting to do kind of good and then it all just fell apart so um in the second attempt um i wanted to try jubilee but they kept her blind so uh, i mean if she's blind she can't put her own blinds down i wanted to put her to have i wanted to try her especially with her being six stars where she has a little bit more you know just a little more beef but it didn't play out like I wanted, so I'll probably bring Black Bolt back. You know, I, I kind of like her kit, you know? I mean, stuns and ray and blinds and, and, and other fun stuff that she does. Um, but 
Yeah, it just didn't work out that way. It did not work out that way. So that's where we're at in the roster. Uh, apologize again for sounding like I'm down. Not gonna lie. The frustrations in the game have have made me think more and more about quitting. And so, you know, if I do, uh, I'll post a video like you see out here. <laughs> this rage quit. Or I rage quit fate grand order. But anyway, that's gonna do it. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, all the other nonsense, and we'll see you in the next video.